So you're gonna be an uncle. Two. Jake's gonna be an uncle, and you know I'm gonna be an uncle. Two. To uh, Zeus's kids. In the bearded dragon. What's up guys, welcome back to another video. But before we get started today, make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe, and don't forget to turn on your post notifications. What's that on your uh, shoulder there, bro? The, the, oh, oh, that's, that's Zeus. Um, so, we kind of have some news, I guess, or some, a little something interesting that happened. I'd say yesterday, did this happen yesterday? I don't know. Yeah, something like but that. But he, Zeus decided to um, do something with the females. He decided uh, to become a other bearded dragon. He decided to become a man. He, he's a man now, and will be a father soon. So basically, what I'm trying to say is that our two female bearded dragons both mated with him, and we will be having eggs soon. I was thinking that we should um, get your bearded dragon a girlfriend. Uh, I think Zeus wants a girlfriend too, so. Is that Zeus's new girlfriend? Wow. She's like, I don't know who Zeus is yet. So in today's video, we're going to be preparing for having bearded dragon babies and we're going to be getting all the supplies we need and such like that for the babies and for the mothers of the babies. Because we're, we're having a kid. Well, we're having like... Many kids. Like 50 like, kids. Like a lot of kids. Like a lot of kids. A lot of kids. A lot of kids. <laughs> Like possibly like sixty kids. That's that's a lot. That's that's like at max. But so waking in my shoes. It's, yeah, I know. What do we need, Jake, for this process? Because uh, I mean, you're the you're more experienced than I am with this. Obviously, I've never dealt with so thirty babies. Yeah. So for this process, we're going to need stuff like an incubator. We're going to need a lay box. We're going to need. We're going to make sure you know all of our females. I guess ha like everything needs to be perfect for them, basically, and set up for them to lay eggs in their enclosure. So they need to have you know enough area to dig and stuff around. Because even in their just their normal enclosures, they're going to want to dig around a lot. So we're going to have to make sure that's fit for them. And I mean, there's not really much we have to do for Zeus. He just did his part already. But he's done. Yeah, we need to get bins. I guess for gonna be ordering an incubator probably yeah one probably or two order. we're probably gonna be ordering two incubators we, we thought about making our own but we we're not having that many eggs to where we need to make like a large big incubator or anything bearded dragon eggs are small and the babies are really small especially so yeah but in today's video we're gonna be filming the process of setting up for baby bearded dragons we're having kids <laughs> we're having kids hey it's not we're not wrong we're having kids we are having children but scaly children Little tiny scaly children. Yeah. And lots of them. A lot of them. Good job, Zeus. You're a daddy now. I don't think he's too thrilled. He's too chill. So hopefully um, we'll have some uh, some good babies from you. Some good genes, right? Yes. Zeus is a nice looking bearded dragon. He sure is. His color is really pretty. He's like, what is this thing in my face right now? So what do you think their kids are going to look like? Well, depends. So I think his kids with Athena are going to be really like, they're going to be like really saturated in color, I feel. Um, cause he has a lot of like oranges, yellows, and like slight blue tint, I feel, to like these more grayish scales. Hopefully it has some cool colors. There's definitely gonna be cool colors in there. We shall see! What do you have to say about the Zeus? What do you have to say, bro? He's like, I just want worms. I just want worms, I just want to be fed. It's not your insect day, I'm sorry. Okay, so obviously we are not going to be the only uncles. Gavin is going to be an uncle too, so we wanted to make him a part of this process and, you know, show him what it's like to prepare for children, I guess. Scaly children. Let's go get them. Scaly kids. So, you're going to be an uncle. <laughs> he's going to be an uncle. You told him, right, Jake? I don't know, but he's going to be an uncle, so I guess here's the news. Okay, I'm just drinking straight up citrus right now. Okay, so you're gonna be an uncle? Two. Jake's gonna be an uncle? And, you know, I'm gonna be an uncle. Two. To uh, Zeus's kids. In the bearded dragon. So we're gonna we're gonna try to prepare for this process, and we think that you should be a part of it since you're gonna be an uncle too, right? Yeah. So put down the headset, and we're gonna go uh, we're gonna go get some supplies. I have to come. Yeah, you're a part of this process, bro. So let's go. Okay, guys, we are on our way currently to Reptile Island, which is where we are going to be getting a, a bunch of supplies for the incubator and for the enclosures of the females that will be laying the eggs. Yeah, what do you think, Adam? He's asleep. I think he's faking. Definitely faking being asleep. 
gonna be an uncle. He's just scared he's gonna be an uncle. What? Uncle Gavin. Oh, oh I missed. I think he just this threw an airpod. I need it. Uh, bummer. Well, uh, that's that. Peace out. Okay guys, so we just finished getting everything. We got some bedding. We're gonna re, re like design uh, one of the females' cages to make it more suitable, just so she can dig a little more. Cause she's never laid eggs before, so she's gonna, we're gonna give her like the environment so she's able to dig. Yeah, we also have her Mickey light, which is what we're gonna be using for the incubator where we put the eggs to actually like process. To it be holds able to, like, the eggs. Yeah, holds the eggs basically while they're getting ready to hatch. Hatch. What else did we get? Where is everything? Else? Um, we, we pretty much just got rats, a bunch of feeders, bedding, for also all the animals, and uh, the I think we also need to get lay boxes. Or oh. those come with the incubator. Well, yeah, we can probably get like a few oh, no, more. No, 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 wait. The actual lay yeah, boxes. Yeah, the lay boxes are different. Yeah. Yeah. So we gotta get maybe we'll go to like like Target or something and get some bins. Yeah. All right, let's do that. So. Okay, guys. So we are. Ta are <laughs> we at. We're at Target. We're at Target, and I believe this is gonna be the place where we can find lay boxes for the bearded dragon. So what do we got, Jake? What do we got? We got this one, maybe? Are these good? I'm thinking, ah, uh, these come all together, though. I mean, we, we need we need, we need, two, though. We need at least two. We got two females. True. So I think maybe, maybe like, that get, one? I believe this is gonna be good. For the beauties, we have about, like, I'd say about five-ish inches worth of soil that she can dig in, and a, a good, how long do you think it is? Like, Probably, like, foot-ish? Foot, a little foot more. maybe a little more than a foot. But, um, but adequate. overall, it's, it's it's definitely adequate. And, um, I mean, I've, I've had, like, lizards lay before that I didn't even expect to lay, like, in just, like, an inch. Like, at least parts where there was just an inch of soil, and this is definitely gonna be good enough. And if Perfect. it isn't, we can always upgrade. So. Cool, hey, hey Jake, you wanna, um, you wanna buy me, like, like, like this fan real quick please that's kind of expensive Brian please um please it's kind of expensive Brian please it's kind of that's kind of expensive just, Brian just 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 ig kinda... ig ignore that ignore the, the price it's just a number bro you know how much like joy it would bring me though it's kind of ugly you can't put a price on joy it's ugly though it hurts my feelings how about we get this one that one's ugly but it's cheaper but ugly way better so let's go home oh, okay fine Alright guys, so we have pretty much everything. We got all the stuff from Target, which is pretty much just the lay box. You know, all the embeddings and the Vermiculite. light. And now we just need to order one more thing, which would be the actual incubator, which is how we're actually gonna hatch the eggs. So, that's fair. That's um, fair. we're not gonna be building our own, but we did find, this was like probably the best possible one I think we could find with the little, you know, research we did at least. And it seemed to have some of the best reviews out of almost everything. And has enough room for, I think, all the beauty eggs that we could possibly have. I think so, yeah. I think we could probably make one work. Worst case, we can get another one. Yeah. Go ahead, hit place order. Okay, well, there we go. And it's done! Yay, beauties. Zeus is gonna be a daddy. Except I'm gonna be an uncle. So am I, so is Gavin. Uncles for, uh, for days. Uncles for president. What? That's gonna be it for this video, guys. Thank you very much for watching. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to turn on your post notifications either when you are uh, I don't know where I was going with that, but That's don't cool. forget to turn on your post notifications. Looking forward to the, uh, the eggs. I am too. I'm looking forward to becoming something other than a son and a brother. I'm gonna be an uncle. That's quite the achievement. You, you could say that. Yeah, sure. Yeah, All I'm right. proud. You should be. I'm proud for you. I was about to say I'm a proud father, but I'm not a father. Zeus is a father. He <laughs> yes, he is. Very good, Jake. Thank you for watching. You're being awkward, Zeus. Ako taco. Okay. You got him? I think he just puffed up. I heard him go in my ear. <laughs> All right, guys. I don't know what that was. Okay.